I study the process of uh, DNA replication initiation at the Gurdon Institute in Cambridge. DNA replication is a fundamental process that all cells have to go through, whereby they make a perfect copy of the blueprint of the cell, what's called the DNA or the genome. Primarily, we study the process of DNA replication in budding yeast. That is the same yeast that is also used to brew beer and bake bread. And it's a fantastic organism to work with because it is just a single cell, so it's very easy for us to manipulate it in the lab. Because budding yeasts divide every 90 minutes, we can get through experiments very quickly. What's much more difficult is to study the process of cell division in a whole organism that's made up of millions and trillions of cells such as we are. And studying this process is important because errors during this process or failures to perfectly duplicate one's DNA leads to the kind of errors that are causative in lots of different kinds of diseases. Most importantly, DNA replication goes wrong during the process of cancer. In 2014, I was elected as an EMBO Young Investigator, which selects the top researchers across Europe under the age of 40. Part of the reason I was given this award was for our work on DNA replication in yeast and then to study the development of vertebrates. Processes we work on are so fundamental to all life on Earth. Every cell uses similar mechanisms in which to divide. Then we've been able to directly translate these studies from budding yeast to vertebrate embryos. For this, we use frogs and we've been able to show that deregulation of the same proteins can control the rate of cell division during early development in frog embryos. So we've identified a new mechanism by which cells can control the rate at which they proliferate. And this is important because uncontrolled proliferation is a feature of human cancer. By studying DNA replication in detail, we hope to not only understand the fundamental process of how a cell divides, but also try and get key insights into the process that is specifically targeted in cancer cells in the clinic.